morning everyone. So I have decided to make a little um, impromptu stuff at Michael's this morning. Um, I was here a couple weeks ago and they were setting up their Christmas stuff. So I'm hoping that they have all their Christmas stuff up. I just got done at Costco and then I'm like, you know what? Michael's is just over the next street over. So I'm like, I'm totally gonna go. <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do today. So of course I thought I would go ahead and bring my camera with me to share with you guys what I find that, that I think is cool. I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna be buying anything today. Um, because I really truthfully have not given Christmas decor much thought yet this year at all. I have been in fall mode and then, you know, just haven't even really thought about it other than it's coming up and I need to do something soon. <laughs> if I do end up buying anything, I will definitely show you what I pick up at the end of this video. But we shall see. We will have to see. <laughs> so anyways, let's go ahead and go on in and see what we can find. I love looking at all the different types of garland that they had. There are so many different pretty ones and fun and quirky ones, but one in particular really stood out to me, which I thought was so adorable, and it's this one right here. How adorable is that? One of the things I know that I'm on the lookout for this Christmas season are greenery picks. I love using little small ones to, you know, pop in here and there around just to add a little bit of color and texture. So I'm on the lookout for some ones that I think that will work for me. And let's not forget about the ribbon. You can never have too much in this time of year. I love the red and white versions, but they also had quite a few really adorable printed ones that I had my eye on. I fell in love with this ribbon right here. Isn't that adorable? It reminds me of a vintage candle I just found at the thrift store a couple weeks ago. I love using these battery operated candles. They give your home that classic cozy Christmas feeling. And these are the really nice ones that come on at dusk and turn off at dawn. I love them. Also need to get myself a new tree topper. I haven't had a tree topper in a couple years.
I am loving all the shapes and sizes of these pre-made ornaments that you can decorate. How much fun would that be to like sit down and paint and glitter and just go to town? I think that'd be so much fun. I thought this little bouquet of greenery and Christmas delightfulness was so beautiful. I'm still on the lookout for some greenery picks, and these might be it. I thought these looked very lifelike. I really like the little pine cones on them, and they were super soft. So these might be the ones that I'll go with, but I will wait and see. But I really love those. I thought they looked very nice. And because it's fun to mix textures, I thought these would work very nicely to add an airy, delicate um, element into the mix. I am a sucker for baby trees and I really liked this version with just a little bit of snow on it. I thought it was so adorable. Not that I need any more baby trees, but these were some nice looking ones. I am also on the lookout for some chargers. I have not jumped onto the chargers bandwagon yet. I don't even have a set of them at all. So I'm looking for some that will be kind of neutral, but yet look sort of Christmassy. And I am really getting into these decorative boxes. They make decorating and wrapping presents super quick and easy. So I have a little stash that I started last year and I hope to continue to add to that and I love these little North Pole ones. I thought they were cute. Another thing that caught my eye were these little birds. They had the red ones and they also had the ones in white and I thought these would be so much fun to add a few to the Christmas tree. I also thought these little buckets were super duper cute. There's a, quite a few different ones that they had that I thought were adorable. These would look so cute with little trees in them or even like some greenery and like some antlers or some stick sticking out of it. There's just so many different ways that you could use these. So I think they would be a very handy thing. at home 
home now and I thought I'd share with you what I picked up. I only picked up two things. None of their Christmas stuff was on sale yet. So I kind of want to wait. I'll probably go back. And there are a few things that I thought was really cool. And I'll probably go back to see if they are on sale. Plus I'm also looking for red and white like open face roses. So they didn't have everything out yet. Which I thought was really, really weird. But that's alright. So I will probably head back. But for right now, I'll, I'll show you what I got. Like I said, I only picked up two things. The first thing I picked up wasn't even a Christmas item. But it is this bunch of flowers right here. Aren't they pretty? They were um, in their discounted um, fall seasonal stuff. So I picked them up because you can never go wrong with some white, like, uh, like roses or, yeah, I think these are like open roses. They were originally $11.99, but I thought they might like 70% off. So I love buying flowers that are off season because you can get a really good deal on them. And these look pretty nice. So I like that. I should have probably picked up two bunches of them, but I only picked up one. So... <laughs> I can definitely use these for my winter decor. I thought it would be really cute with some red berries and like a little teacup or a small little pitcher or something and then a little bit of fresh clipped greens from the trees. I think that would look so pretty. So definitely can use these all year round. So I thought that was a good bargain to pick those up. And then the other thing I picked up is one, the one and only <laughs> Christmas item that I picked for, up from there. And they are these lights right here. They are battery operated. They do have a timer. Um, and they do have a couple different options. Like you can leave them on. Or you can have them blink. Or you can have them um, fade in and out. Which is kind of cool. So these were $12.99. But I did have a 20% off discount. So I got a couple bucks off of that. So that was really nice. Um, I think these are so pretty. They had the, them in clear. And they also had them in colored. Um, glass bulbs. The bulbs are like crackled glass kind of bulbs. Hopefully you'll be able to see that. But I thought these would look really fun on my shelf above my bed. That's what I'm thinking I'll probably use them for. So I'm pretty excited about that. So those are the two items that I picked up at my Michaels haul this week. Even though I didn't buy a whole lot, I got a lot of um, inspiration so I kind of need to check what I already have and then probably go back and do a haul so that's most likely what will happen and so that's pretty fun I hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did hit that thumbs up and I will see you very soon in my next video bye now